amidst COVID-19 pandemic, Federal Mundo National High School officially opens school year 2020-2021. They were already ready in August when they thought they would open on August 24. If I am not mistaken, they are even more ready now. Palas spokesman Harry Roque Jr. told reporters a week before the president's recommendation on the opening of classes. The long wait is over. It is the date that every teacher across the country awaits. It is now October 5, 2020, World Teachers Day, and the recommended date when teaching learning activities will officially open to start school year 2020-2021. For Federal Mundo National High School faculty and staff, it is not just a day but a day to be noted and worthy of setting the alarms and wake one up earlier than the previous days. Nalugod po namin minay-welcome ang lahat sa 2020-2021 na panuroan ngayong tahon. Although students of learning modules were already properly packed in envelopes a week ago, there are still processes and procedures to undertake before distributing them to the learners. And these were tattooed in each teacher's minds. As early as 6 in the morning, teachers, especially the class advisors from junior and senior high school departments, sorted their students' envelopes in the proper boxes delegated to different drop-off points. These drop-off points were modified by the school brigade escuela coordinator, Mr. Kermit S. Agbas, according to the problems the school received and encountered after the conducted dry run and simulations in August. Draft-up points were conceptualized to avoid a large number of parents to come to school to claim their learner self-learning modules. Without this drop of points, everyone's safety would be compromised since the school has a total of 2,342 junior and senior high school enrollees as of October 5, 2020. After sorting the envelopes to designated drop of point boxes, disinfection was carried out by the school maintenance before loading them to the available vehicles for distribution. This is to abide to the health protocols imposed amidst pandemic and to ensure that the envelopes containing self-learning modules are free from any microorganisms that may harm the receivers. Available and suitable means of transportation were utilized in the delivery of the modules to the learners. The past simulation helped the school in deciding on which means of transportation is suitable to carry and deliver the modules to the different drop-off points. Regarding most of the far-flung areas where more than a quarter of the school's enrolling learners resides, motorcycles, tricycles, and cars of the teachers were used to make the teaching learning activities for school year 2020-2021 continue and possible. Knowing that Federal Mundo National High School has the largest number of students among other secondary schools in the municipality of Mansalay, the local government unit has lent its service car to the school to assist in the delivery, preferably in the four areas. At 7.15 in the morning, the envelopes containing the self-learning modules were already loaded in different vehicles for distribution. Everything and everyone's ready now. As mandated by DepEd Secretary Yunor Magtolis Briones, school year 2020-2021 was formally opened 
with the traditional morning school ceremony and followed by a ring of bell which signals the start of the teaching and learning activities for the school year. Yes, this might be very new to everyone. Still, Federal Mundo National High School faculty and staff welcome the school year with enthusiasm and hope that this new normal and trend in education will end well and successfully. Federal Mundo National High School did not encounter any difficulty and problem on the first distribution of self-learning modules to the learners. Despite of the fact that the school has a large number of enrolled learners, teachers made sure that all of the learners receive their modules in print format. No matter how far the area the students reside, Federal Mundo National High School will find a way to reach the students. Just like what they did in the far-flung barangay of Panaytayan which is composed of different widely spread sitios. Proud and honored, but a quarter of Federal Mundo National High School's total enrollment this school year come from this far-flung area. Indigenous peoples make up this group of learners. To conform with the Department of Education's mission to ensure that learning must continue despite the COVID-19 pandemic, Federal Mundo National High School devised strategies and alternatives to reach this minority group come rain or shine. Challenge but determined to hand the modules to the learners, teachers assigned on this drop of point headed early Friday morning, which the parents suggested with the expectations that they will walk across an unfavorable trail due to previous day's heavy rains. Despite of the risk along the way to meet the parents, Federal Mundo National High School teachers drove motorcycles, Lands. and cross rivers with the desire to bring the self-learning modules to the IP students. As expected, parents were already there and waiting. They were all excited to receive their child's modules but did not forget the procedures in claiming them. They made sure that health protocols were properly followed by each of them. Upon reaching the drop of points, the assigned teachers arranged the envelopes containing self-learning modules by grade level. Again, they oriented the parents about the procedures in claiming their child's envelopes containing the self-learning modules. These include writing of their names in the logbook and compliance to the health protocols imposed by the IATF regarding crowds. After a flashback on the salient events on the opening of school year 2020-2021, and the first distribution of the self-learning modules in printed format to the learners, I would say that Federal Mundo National High School has encountered a minimum of difficulties, challenges, and problems last October 5, 2020. This is so because of the conducted dry run before the actual distribution activities as DepEd opens the school year. 
But, given another set of challenges, Federal Mundo National High School faculty and staff is willing to welcome these challenges brought by COVID-19 pandemic. They swear that their passion to continue to provide learning opportunities to their students despite of the pandemic will keep on burning because to witness parents' eagerness and desire to educate their children will always motivate and inspire them to do what they enunciated in their arts. To see students' willingness and enthusiasm to learn will always motivate and inspire them to live by their arts and to learn each parents and students dream to improve and be better in the future will always remind them of their duties and responsibilities as molders of future beings and leaders. These things will always make us teachers despite of the present situation that the world faces. Because we are sincere when we said that we will always be of service no matter what the circumstance is. Thus, with the leadership of our school principal, Mr. Ricky A. Apostol, school personnel and parents working hand in hand, and with the collaboration of the people in the municipality, the opening of school year 2020-2021 amidst the COVID-19 pandemic at Fed Del Mundo National High School went smoothly and successfully. Hurrah, Department of Education!